your shelves. I'm Judy, and I'm Michael. Today we're going to talk about three things we love about Calico. Calico. It was designed by Kevin Russ and published by Flight Out Games.、Mm-hmm. This game is amazing. <laughs> I have to say, it, it, yeah. Before we even say the top three things we love about it, it is such a great game that it was so difficult for me to pick three things I love about this game. Very. It, it looks very simple, though, right? Looks, yeah. It looks cute and simple, but yeah, it's almost like <laughs> oh, patch. It's kind of like blanket, and there's cats. Yeah, yeah. We underestimate. Underestimated. You you feel like it's going to be a nice, easy stroll、mm-hmm. for a Sunday over a Sunday morning coffee、yeah. or something, but <laughs> comes with canvas. You just draw easy peasy. Yeah, not really. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. So anyways, there are many things that I love about this game,、mm-hmm. and I had to choose three. So why don't we get to it?、Um, but if you are new to the Nerd Shelves and you haven't done so already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button below and the notification bell to be notified when we post more fun board gaming videos. Yeah, or to hear us jibber jabber. We're really good at that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Why don't we get to it? Let's go. Okay. Okay. So three things we love about Calico.、Do、I'm gonna want... start. You're gonna start. Okay. I was just gonna ask you. Okay. It's hard because I have like thirty, and then I have I to.、Know. It's difficult. Yeah. Yeah. Eliminate some of them, and then down to twenty, and then ten. <laughs> totally then,、oh, right. Oh my goodness. So let's leave number one for last, and let's start with number three. Number three. Yes. Okay. So I really like the components of、mm. the game. When we did、um, unboxing, I was already so excited. I was squealing. <laughs>、um, so there are a couple things in in this game. It's it's very simple too. It's、mm-hmm. not too complicated. So I love the scoring pad. <laughs> of course, you as do. As <laughs> you all know, I really love it.、Uh, it just make your make your game so much easier at the end. You don't have to find pen and other、uh, the, the the paper and all the stuff.、Mm-hmm. Well, you still need to find a pen. Yeah, you do. But you that's okay. Find, yeah, it's but it's true. Scoring pens、yeah. do make it so much easier. And then when you play, you can see how much you scored the the previous game. Yep. Which is fun. I like that.、Yep. That's I mean, we do keep our scores on an app, but、mm-hmm. it's always nice to have the old games in the box. Totally. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah.、Um, the other component I really like is how they dual layer board because <laughs> their material is very thick cardboard and.、Yep. It's just so nice to lay down the tile. Yeah, incredible. And move around.、Yeah. It's quite smooth. I like yes, it. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Component quality is amazing. In this I think、game. you were excited about the dual layer board. About yeah, it just the color and、yeah. everything, right? Yeah. Yes. What is yours? My number three is dual layered. Player boards. <laughs> <laughs> I thought so. I、oh, I am a sucker for dual layered player boards. I mean, okay, you are right. The overall component quality of this game is top notch. The canvas bag is beautiful and is great quality.、Yeah. Everything is thick cardboard. It, it beautiful, but I love dual layered player boards. It make the the game just so much smoother, right?、Uh, yeah, it's so. F-、uh, yeah, I mean, okay. Speaking of their function, they're great because games like and I keep bringing it up when we talk about dual layered player boards, but terraforming Mars drives me bonkers. Sorry. <laughs> you have <laughs> a little flimsy mat, and you have all these cubes everywhere,、yeah. and then somebody reaches for something, bumps the table, and pfft, everything goes everywhere. Yeah. Drives me nuts.、Mm-hmm. I bought the expansion to Terraforming Mars, which came with dual layered player mats, but that's a different video. Yeah. So, speaking of their function, yeah, amazing.、Mm-hmm. But you're right. It also just they just it feels so nice sticking、mm-hmm. the components in and they fit perfectly. And ah,、oh, god, especially just love it. especially with how you play this game because、yeah. you have to fit the tiles、yes. next to each other. Yeah. If they don't do dual layer board, it's really hard、yeah. to not move around.、Okay? Absolutely, especially if you have, let's say, you have all of your tiles around, and there's one or two spots surrounded by other tiles. Oh my goodness! Right, and you go to stick it in, they might spread out everywhere. But yeah, dual layer player mats for me is my number three. 
<laughs> could have been my number one because I love them that much. But it doesn't really have anything to do with the gameplay and the game itself. So mm -hmm. I put it as... No I had to make my list, but I put it as number three. Yeah. It just... Yeah, there's so much more to love about this game. Yes. True. Yeah. Okay. Those so... Components. All right, that's number three. Yeah, let's do number two. Go ahead. All right, number two. Oh, wow. Mm-hmm. <laughs> number two, I have to say... I love it, but I hate it. <laughs> Love-hate relationship. Yeah, Ju Judy's, Judy's story of Judy's life. I love it, but I hate it. But I love it because they made this game so much better. Mm -hmm. I think that's a key point of mm -hmm. this game. But I hate it because it was so hard. <laughs> it is so hard. Oh, it is, is the it? Um, design gold tiles. Oh, the design gold tiles. So when you play this game, well, everyone knows um, you match colors and you get a buttons to put on. Mm -hmm. And if you found the numbers of patterns um, where the cat sits, yeah. then you pick up the mm -hmm. cat token. But it's not that easy. Right. There are three. Um, it, it's it's design like, goal like you tokens. said, yeah, design, design goal, goal, right? Tokens, yeah. You have to have one of them is, oh, I hate it so much. It's like you around that token has to be all different color. Right. Then yeah. you get 10 points. Yeah, totally. Basically, the design, <laughs> goal, <me> not. <laughs> the design goal tokens, they're, all, they're different in every game, but mm -hmm. they have to do with the, the tokens that go around it, that it's surrounded yeah. by mm -hmm. a certain pattern or something yeah. like that. Yeah. They, they give so you different hard. tasks, yeah. and I, if you complete it, you get those extra points. Yeah. And there are a couple games I just try to focus on those yeah. instead of three colors the same or the cat's pattern. I just try to focus on those ones, and I you did. I it. can say I, I no, I didn't play really well. <laughs> well, no, that one game you got all three of those. There's three on every board, and you got three of them one game. That one. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. You know, oh, it's hard. <laughs> it is so hard, but um, so good. It is. Yeah. I, yeah. But you are exactly right, and I think you hit the point there. Is that mm -hmm. If you focus on those, you can't really focus on the others. Mm -hmm. If you focus on the cat tiles, you can't really focus on... Yeah. The, like, you can't... You want to do everything, but you but can't. You can't. <laughs> so that's kind of the point of the game. Yeah. yeah. And it would be boring, really, if you only focus on color and pattern. Right. So those add up, like, spice up the game. Absolutely. And I love it. That is such a good point. You know, that is... They took a game, mm -hmm. which was about laying tiles and was great, and then they just added this one. He's like, "Here, here's a nice game for you to play. Now take that." <laughs> <laughs> it's real fun. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah, so hard, but you're right. Yeah. Makes the game so much better. Yeah, so much yep, better. So I, I still love it. It just, whew, my yeah. head was on smoke. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. Totally. <laughs> What's your number two? My number two. So gonna the be number the same. two thing that I love about Calico. So, I, I mean. We talked about component quality. Yeah. Um, my number two is similar to that. Mine is just, I, hmm, this is very general, but the design of the game itself. Mm -hmm. I think that, like, the component quality is great, but what I do love about it is, is, is how the colors are so bright. The pat, the, then there's different patterns, mm -hmm. and the cats are like super cute. And super. so it's it's not really the artwork, but the design of the game, mm -hmm. for me, just makes it look so amazing on the table. It's like ice cream to the eyes, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. And, and it's it, simple. It's so silly because usually that doesn't affect how much I like a game. Mm -hmm. I mean, I love Stefan Feld games. Mm -hmm. Stefan Feld games aren't always the prettiest, but I love them. Mm -hmm. So I'm not really, I don't really fall into that, it has to be a beautiful game. Mm -hmm. But th there's just something about this game. The cats are super cute. Super cute. They all have different names. Um, it, the, the, des the colors and the designs on the tiles themselves, I don't know, it just, it looks amazing on the table. Mm -hmm. And if you're at a convention or something like that and you're playing, and it's on the table, everybody's gonna stop and see what you're playing because mm -hmm. it's so, Pretty. Yes. It, it, the, the pattern is simple. It is simple. Very simple. It is. Think about it. If it would be very complicated pattern to design, mm -hmm. that would be very overwhelmed, yeah, right? definitely. But the fact that they choose polka dot, stripes, yeah. and just some other patterns, yeah. 
it's simple. And the color is simple too, not too crazy. It's mm -hmm. very, you already know those colors yeah. and they, they're very different from each other. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but, but other than that, I mean, that's my number two, mm -hmm. which surprised me. I didn't think that would make my top three list, but I think it's a, an important component of this game. It's just mm -hmm. how beautiful, the design and how beautiful it is. Mm -hmm. And simple and yeah. just ice cream to your eyes. <laughs> exactly. So but that's the, my number two. The fact that it's cat theme. Wow, th that's got you. Right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Definitely. All right. So My number, number one. one. Okay. It's exciting. Are you? Yes. Okay. Similar to number two. Okay. I like the gameplay, how, um, how they design the gameplay. Okay. So let me explain it. Yeah. <laughs> so a lot of games, they give you a lot of cards on hand, a lot of things laying on the table. This game, give you only two tokens on your hand, mm. only three tiles on the table to choose from, and once you're, you you pick one from there, you draw another one to replace it. Yeah. And for scoring, if you have three colors that match, you put one the same uh, color of button, mm -hmm. score on top of it, if you get the um, numbers of pattern that the cat require, uh, re request, then you put it on top. It's simple. It's not overwhelming like, I have five cards, what do I do, what do I do, yeah. what do I do? Good point. Right? It's just like your second one, right? It's, it's ice cream to your eyes and it's simple, mm -hmm. yet you have to think of your strategy and you keep changing your strategy. Yeah. Games that make you keep changing your strategy it's a good game. Absolutely. That's, yeah. wow, what a good point. It's, I see where you're going with that. Mm -hmm. I, I definitely understand how the design of the game play, the mechanics of the game are simple. That's it, yeah. yeah you have a two tiles to choose from, a couple to choose from on the table, mm -hmm. and then you either get three colors and get a button or match the cat tiles and get a cat. Yeah. Simple. Yeah. But wow, is it not simple because it, is a brain burner. Yeah. We had yeah. a playthrough video, right? Yeah. yeah. You see how long we took, right? <laughs> yeah. We just sit there like, uh, those two, I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I actually, spo not spoiler, but a little secret here. I edited a lot of the, there's a lot of quiet time of us thinking. I actually just kind of edited that out of the video because there was a lot. A lot of but thinking. <laughs> that's a really good point. And I think that's, uh, that is a brilliant, it just shows how brilliant the designer is. Yes. That you can take something so simple, yet have it be so complicated. Yeah. Yeah. Good one. Yeah. Yeah. That totally makes the game. That should be that, your number one. Yeah. Yep. Love it. What cool. is yours? Okay. So we've kind of touched a little bit on this with all of the ones actually. So, yeah. um, but my number one is I, I love the way that, and like we said, mm -hmm. There's so many things you want to do, mm -hmm. but you can't do all of them. So yeah. my number one is the multiple ways to score. Yeah. And they're all equally valid. Mm -hmm. They're all, they all score you points. Yeah. And they're all important. Yeah. But you can't do them all. Right. So there's basically, there's three ways to score and you're only adding up three things, but yeah. all three are important. Mm -hmm. Right. So if, like you said, if you get three patches or tokens, mm -hmm tiles of the same color same in color. a group, yeah. you get a button. Yeah. If you get your patterns, which match the cat tiles, you get a cat token. And the third thing, like we talked about, if you can meet the requirement of the, the, those goal tiles, yeah. the design goals all the way around it, mm -hmm. you get those points. That's it. There's three of them, mm -hmm. but you score all three and you can never do all Three. No. So for me, that is what <laughs> makes this game. Yeah. Because, yeah, it's not a race. It's not everybody looking for the same end goal. Mm -hmm. It's not everybody working on the same thing. There are multiple ways to score. Yeah. And in this game, you want to do everything. Yeah. But you can't. And th this <laughs> is this is a game that, there, like you say, those three ways to score, right? Mm -hmm. You don't have to hurt people's feeling. You kind of just focus on your yeah. your, your patchwork. It's true. it's true. So that that being said, still really hard. Yeah, yeah. 
I don't know. Maybe if we played more, we I would be able to look at your board and say, I know you need that tile, so I'm going to take it. But I think there's so much going yeah. on with my own board. I was like, I'm not even looking. I, I can't even <laughs> think about your board. I need my board. And yeah. the other thing too is those design tiles that we talked about, or design goal tiles, in the beginner setup, we each have the same design goals. Mm -hmm. But in a more advanced setup, we each have different ones that we're going Very for. Different. So that even changes it even more. Yeah. But yeah, that's my number one. That is so good. Yeah, so good. <laughs> when we did um, unboxing, I mentioned when we see the token, there is another game that came out from... Mm. Yeah. So Cascadia. Cascadia. Yeah. I am really looking forward to it. Yeah. I, I, I think it's different than this one. Maybe. But I don't know much about it, but yeah. we'll, we'll look into it. I'll come home with it. <laughs> of course you will. So... I actually can't recommend this game enough. I I know. I have heard so many people talk about it. Yep. I have never heard anybody say anything negative about it. It's no. part mm -hmm. of the design that I love too, which I didn't actually mention, is it's such it's a small box, which I love. Mm -hmm. It's component quality is great. It's beautiful. The art is incredible. It plays in Wonderful. what, 40, 30 minutes to 45 minutes? It's mm -hmm. not super long, mm -hmm. but oh boy, does your brain start smoking when you're trying to think in this game. Yeah, so good. <laughs> it's so good, yeah. And I think, I remember when, when we did unboxing, there's no space wasted in there. In the box, yeah. Yeah, so, yep. so they actually really use very, um, very, very... Wisely. Yeah. The space very wisely. It's the, efficient, it's, right? The design is yep. really throughout everything. Yep. Yeah, it's I thorough, it. yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. So there you go. Those are the three things we love about Calico. And Calico. boy, do we love Calico. Yes. Top shelf, middle shelf, Top. bottom shelf. Uh, on a shrine. <laughs> <laughs> it's not even... A, uh, no, it's definitely on my top shelf. You? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Yeah. All okay, right. everybody. So there you go. I hope you enjoyed the video. And like Judy said earlier, lots of jibber jabber. Jibba jabber. <laughs> so go ahead and get another game off of your nerd shelves. Take care. Bye. Bye.